I'm trying to come up with an intro. What have we got? Ratatouille, a heart-shaped balloon. Get your rat out. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's a bit obscene. And I've also made like a lovely mermaid out of What if we do something from like the movie Ratatouille? We're not going to do something from the movie. If anything, we want to stay away from that. Okay. Like a little mice just like popping? We're not going to have a mouse. Stop! Get over the mouse, it's not happening. All right. And what's truly wonderful about ratatouille, and this dish in particular, is that it's all eat the prep work. And did a little mice help you with the prep work? No, Valley. You need to get over that, Phil. So, it's all in the prep work. Like I said, once you've completed that, it's pretty much done. I mean, it's not done. Obviously, the ingredients are still raw. So, you need to throw it in a pan and cook it, but don't worry, I'm going to show you how to do that. You and a little friend? No friend, Valley. Look, I'm just saying I could put a little mice in the courgettes. I'm going to put you in the f***ing courgettes. Olive oil. Once that's nice and hot, we want to start adding our aubergine. So we want to fry these for around five minutes. Now, as you can see, I've still got some more aubergine left. Don't worry, we may have to do this in batches. I could put little mice just sitting right here. Don't you dare. It's going to go a nice golden colour. And once the veg starts to go golden brown and is a bit soft, we're then going to transfer it into this bowl. Our chips in there as well. Add your pepper. Chopped onion. Garlic. We want to add our basil stalks. I've got a bit of thyme here. Just a little bit of red wine in here. The smell of red wine, thyme and garlic and onions. Red onions. So good. I'm actually going to just put that face in there. You know, mice have got really good smells. That's what makes them really good cooks. I really have just about had it up to here with your ratatouille stuff today, honestly. Okay, I'm going to tip the rest of the veg into the pan. Give that a good stir. Add fresh tomatoes. Look at all those gorgeous colours. Plum tomatoes in. Second tin. Give that a good mix. Add a tablespoon of balsamic vinegar, a bit of sea salt, some pepper, and give it a good stir. You can add a little bit of tomato puree to thicken that up. So you want to turn it down to simmer, pop the lid on and let it simmer for about 30 minutes. Oh yeah, look at that. Just throw in our basil leaves. As they are, give that a stir in. Oh yeah, this looks great. Just zest a lemon. Just give that a stir in. Then you just dig in. Mm. That is good. You see? We didn't even need to reference the film. Yeah, but you forget who's editing this. Sally, don't.